Hello everyone, it's Josh again and we're back to another video. I haven't done any tutorial videos in this channel so why not make a tutorial video in this channel because what if it blows up suddenly and it will be the video that saves my entire channel from not being monetized and I'm just going to be a sad, lonely, broke youngster inside the Philippines. Anyways, we're going to make some transparency CDs. I'm just going to put a picture and example right here. I actually thought about giving some to my classmates since I don't have anything to give them. Whenever I do some crafts, I always make some for myself and make some for my friends and my classmates and my other relatives. I'm going to do some glass art in DVDs like these. And I don't even know how. No one even place sabong in my family if you don't know what sabong is it's basically just chicken fighting and whoever loses kill himself and because of debt and all that basically it's a corrupt game which i don't want to touch about so i have discovered also a method of how to actually split dvds in half because i've been said to actually take off these stickers from the dvds which i cannot possibly do i've done the tape Thing, and then it didn't work so I needed to come up with a solution so I ran across a video where they basically just split the CD in half and there's one side which is clear and one side which has the imprinted logo I have myself this um, I don't know what this is basically what I've done is that you see this but basically there are two parts I am going to take to split them using this so I'm just going to Please, if you're a child, don't do this without any supervision from any adult. One of the CDs that I've actually um, used to do this snapped and it almost chopped off my finger. So as you can see right there, this spot right here, there you go. see that I've taken off that part right there. So right now I'm going to do is that I'm going to put it back again and then go around, wear gloves first before doing this because it's very dangerous. But it pays off at the end, but not technically. Technically, it doesn't pay off at the end when you basically have a wonderful piece of art, but your hand is chopped off and then you have only one finger left. Oh, okay. This is the part that you want to have. This has about two layers. One is this um, holographic thingy and this blue, shall we say, um, stuff to it. So technically what other people do is that they take tape and then they place it onto the holographic stuff right here. Yeah, right there. And then it and it goes off. But the problem there is that it leaves some residue right here. Sticky stuff which you don't want to have. Use alcohol. Spray it there and then you just rub it off and then it's gone. So it has like this purple stuff right here. So what I am going to do right now is that I'm going to take some soap and put this into the sponge and then rub it right here. As you can see right there, I'm scrubbing it off. But the good thing about this is that it doesn't leave any sticky stuff on it. So I'm cleaning off. See, as you can see right there, it's starting to get much more clear. And if I try to wash it, see, now it's much more clear. I'm just going to continue on scrubbing this thing. And as you can see, you guys, that's it. But sadly, I cannot use um, some of them because the sticker just won't come off. And which is sad because it's a waste. So I'm just going to take this thing off now. Oh, so look at this. I can take off the plastic foil. Oh, but what if I can actually just... Oh my gosh, guys, look. I hope this comes off. I hope all of it comes off. Okay, there it is. Oh no. This is supposed to be satisfying. Bro, 
Look at that. Don't have to scrub anything off anymore. But it's very fragile. I can like rip it apart like right now, but I don't want to because in case if I need it, I'm just going to place it right here. Okay, so I have most of them done now. So right now, I'm just going to wash off all of them and then let's start painting. So as you can see, all of them are now naked. They're obviously not that clear since they're all wet. So I'm just going to wipe them out with my own towel because that's how unsanitary I am. Boom! And I don't know why is the... If you like notice, I've been a little bit more hard on this and the scrubbing. They're very different, just like this guy. Because this one is the most satisfying thing that we just ripped off with. Sorry. Hello? We're going to paint them basically because why am I getting so boring when vlogging? Like literally no one cares about me anymore. Okay, so I have here some paper. I'm going to trace out some designs right here. I wanted to make use of the transparency of the disc. What I'm going to do now is just going to trace them right here. I'm going to draw some designs. So specifically, I'm going to also um, look at the flaws of the thing. So I have these spots of blue stuff right here that I cannot take off. So I'm going to make a design that is fit for it so that you won't see the spots on it. Yeah, so that's about it. Right now, I'm just going to wait for this thing to dry and then I'm going to take another one of these guys and then I'm going to also paint on them. Okay, so as you can see you guys, I've already triple coated and, and about like four coats now. I have a plan for this thing to become like clouds and like I'm going to make it a little bit more bluish or pinkish or maybe orangey or something. I also made this strawberry one and I'm also going to do some other stuff right there. I'm done with this, but I'm not sure if I can say that this is done because it looks it looks okay, but I cannot say that it's perfect. I wanted to see that when my friends get this, they're going to be like, oh look, it's clouds, not a perspective of a donut being eaten alive or something like that. So what I'm going to do right now, guys, is that I'm actually just going to Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, take that out. Take I'm not going to do a time lapse actually because I'm out of storage in my phone right now. So basically, I'm just going to do all of it and then I'm going to show it at the end. So, Okay, you guys, so I'm about to pass it. Guys, look, my teacher gave me some chocolate. I'm going to put them into each of them. Right here. Right here. 